good evening everybody welcome to the channel um, Inspector C and Kato on the case of this uh, bird fowling putting uh, food on the park success I've just filmed somebody fell in the park I've got video evidence now of somebody um, actually feeding birds <clears throat> Uh, all the birds came eating the food etc and of course that's an offence to uh, feed birds or give food to birds on a public park um, to feed birds as far as I know um, in the amount she was doing this lady was doing it maybe just a bit today but you know, um, wherever it's still against the lure. Now, the object now was just to give the girl, lady, girl, friend, wherever, where you want, give the girl a warning to say, look, can you stop fouling the park? We have to pick our dog poo up, our dog poo. Does, you know, what you're doing is just, just the same. You know, it's fouling the park. Well, it's a bit of food two ton of food, a, a, a bit of bread or whatever, or litter or whatever, it's the same law. And there's one law for everybody and not just one for this girl, this lady uh, who's fell in the park, not far from where uh, I am now. But the council and the environmental officer has told me to put it on film uh, in the evidence and of course I can't show you the evidence, of course, because I don't want to do that. It's not fair to the woman. She just wants a warning to stop her doing it. She wants to feed birds, have all the birds come into her garden on her property. She can feed them on her property. But this property in front of us is the park. It's a park that is, you know, for everybody to use. And you don't just throw waste food on it. You know, I mean, we're going to sit on the park in the summertime, sit outside, and of course the birds at the same time, the birds are going to come here regular because they know they've got a food source and she's feeding them maybe three times a day. And it is a very cold day today and uh, I understand birds need food. So I like the dilemma now what to do. <clears throat> um, I would think, I have to think on it. My uh, associate, um, who had a dog eating some food, some food that he upset the dog, had to have a vet bill of sixty pound. So, you know, maybe she just wants a warning to stop her doing it, uh, so the dogs don't eat her uh, waste food. They're not going to get an infection or anything else. You know, so um, that's just maybe a polite warning telling her we've got the evidence what the council wanted we don't want to report the woman but just tell her to stop doing it I just got here 15 minutes I just sat down and uh, I just set up the dash cam but I just got enough um, and she wasn't really I actually seen her empty the bucket but it just got a bit blurred because she just came out at the wrong time so technically we didn't actually see her emptying the bucket but we can see enough evidence as she's walking onto the park from a house emptying waste food and that is the law you cannot do it it's just like my dog Cato now if I went on the park and left his poo I'm committed an offence I can walk on the park but if he fouls the park I pick it up and of course she's doing the complete opposite by taking waste food and throwing it onto the park anyway I'll have to have a think about it and what to do uh, maybe give her a polite warning we know where it is what the person is doing it now so maybe a polite warning uh, will end the, will end it anyway I'm gonna leave it there thanks very much and um, we'll get back to you on this